This is Chris Fidales. Like, subscribe. Subscribe to Team W Wrestling on YouTube. Subscribe to my other channel, World of Chris. And subscribe to this channel, Chris Fidales. And follow me on Twitter, Instagram, and both of my TikToks. I'll be down there in the description box. And I am here to do my AEW Collision June 17th, 2023 reviews. So here we go, talking about tonight's AEW Collision, which is the first ever episode of Collision. Now, let's just go ahead and just talk about the set and everything. Now, the set freaking looks amazing. I'm not even going to lie. Like, the stage and the ramp and all that looks better than Dynamite and Rampage and all that stuff. Like, it, it really does. It, it, it looks way better. Not only that, the announce table for the announcers is not up there at the stage. It's actually at ringside, like WWE, pretty much. And not only that, speaking about announcers and stuff like that, uh, we got two announcers that's uh, going to be on Collision and stuff, and that is Kevin Kelly and Nigel McGuinness. They're the ones that's going to be announcing Collision. I think Jim Ross was actually supposed to be as well, like a three-person announce team. But, like, uh, I know I seen, like, a picture earlier with uh, Jim Ross with a black eye. Apparently, he fell or whatever. Uh, you know, hopefully he's all good and everything. So, recover quickly, JR. But, yeah, uh, I think he's supposed to be out there, but I don't know. Uh, that's what I was hearing about. But Kevin Kelly and Nigel McGinnis are on the announced team. And you know what? Freaking Kevin Kelly, so underrated as an announcer, you know. He did, gr he did pretty good in WWE back in the day, but... And his good work was in Ring of Honor, at least. But, yeah, he's a he's damn good, you know, underrated announcer. But, yeah, and same for Nigel McGuinness, you know. But, yeah, uh, let's just go ahead and talk about the first segment. Now, we kick off the show with CM Punk. CM Punk making his return because uh, collisions in Chicago, Illinois tonight. Uh, and, yeah, CM Punk returns. He comes out there with a freaking red bag and... You know, some shoes tied around his neck and all that stuff. And he comes out there and he says that he's been gone for 10 months and everything because of the torn tricep and all that stuff. And he's happy to be back because he loves the fans and he knows the fans love him and all that stuff. So, yeah, that's what CM Punk was talking about. And then, uh, you know, CM Punk was talking about how he's going to be in the match tonight, all that stuff. And then he was talking about how he needs to apologize and all that. And he apologized to the people that's actually soft, soft, or, uh, soft, just like their favorite wrestlers, so, yeah, um, there you go right there, but then, uh, he was talking about what's in the red bag and all that stuff, and pretty much referring to the, uh, AEW World Heavyweight Championship, pretty much talking about how he never lost the title or whatever, pretty much he's, uh, you know, he's a claiming champion, pretty much the reclaiming champion, uh, because obviously he never lost the title at all. He never got pinned or submitted. He just had to relinquish it. So yeah, he said up until he gets beaten, then, you know, they can have the title. But yeah, that's what CM Punk said. And then he was talking about uh, and how he had the best matches, like the best doll collar match and all that stuff. And then he was talking about uh, how everybody think that he's going to put these boots in the middle of the ring and, you know, call it night or whatever, you know. But he says he ain't going to do that because he's going to stay here and be competing and because he loves you know, professional wrestling, so yeah, that's what he was saying, and yeah, just good stuff from CM Punk, pretty good promo, but yeah, uh, he kicked off the show, and later on tonight, he'll be teaming up with FTR to take on Samoa Joe, Jay White, and Juice Robinson tonight in a six-man tag team match, knowing that they got many more matches, Miro will be returning tonight, Andrade El Idolo will be t returning, and he'll be taking on Buddy Matthews. But up next, we're going to be seeing the first match of the night, the TNT Champion Wardlow versus Luchasaurus 101 for the TNT Championship. So, yeah, that match will be up next on Collision. So, yeah, see you guys later. Until then.